Hey, Coach Adam Lincoln here from I Love Basketball TV. We are here back with Hector. And Hector, a lot of people want us to know how do you get that strong core, right? And well, I'm going to keep my shirt on, but trust me, I look exactly the same with the core under the shirt, I promise you. Um, but here's what we're going to do. We're going to show you a couple of our favorite ab exercises because uh, here's something that I think a lot of athletes, especially basketball players, don't understand about core. Now, having a six pack is, is, is not only a matter of just having strong abs, it's also nutrition, eating right, but we're gonna stick just on the basics of your strength and getting your core stability to the highest level we possibly can. Now, now let me ask you right now, can you flex your abs for me? All right, now is that is that flex? Can you flex them any more than that right now? Go find with them. What'd you do? Yeah, I would like to locate that. So that, see that, he, you flexed him a little bit more, right? That is the difference between, you know, running fast and jumping high, or not running quite that fast and not jumping as high as you can. It's that extra little bit that you may not even realize you have, and getting that out of you. So let's show you a couple drills to, to really concentrate on that string. Okay, we have three variations that we're going to show you of what we call our six inches series. Now, what Hector's going to do first is he's going to bring his feet six inches off the ground. Notice he's going to keep his shoulders off a little bit. He's got his hands underneath him, but not he's not sitting on his hands right now. He's going to hold that. So you're going to feel a lot in the core itself right here, okay? So we're going to let him hold that for a little bit. Now, when it comes to exercises like this, you're going to want to hold this position until your technique starts to flail up a little bit and starts to mess up a little bit. The second variation here is our pitter-patter. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our feet and we're going to pitter-patter. And that's just going to activate your core a little differently. It's not going to just be stagnant in that position. It's going to cause, uh, cause a little motion here. So this is our next series here. Notice how he hasn't put his feet down yet and he's continuing to do this exercise. The next is going to be our crisscross. So we're going to crisscross. Perfect. Same, same concept. We're going to have a little different motion here. I can hear Hector starting to, to feel it here. He's starting to breathe. And uh, yeah, it's a very challenging. So Hector, you can drop them now. So this is an exercise that you can add to your workout. Notice we're on a basketball court. You do not need any equipment. And Hector's getting better right now by doing this exercise. So you can mix it right into your training today. So saying that, if you like this, give us a like below. Let us know what else you would like from I Love Basketball, Coach Rock, myself. Um, and we've got some really cool stuff coming for you. As always, if you'd like to get uh, some, some free vertical jump and basketball training, click this link right here. Just uh, click that link and we're going to ask you for your email so we know where to send you some cool free basketball training and vertical jump training. Uh, as always, thank you so much. Comment below with anything else we can do for you. We will talk to you soon.